You want to speak to how the big brains of modern day humans actually reveals that we are evolved? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's not even just big brains, right? We're losing our wisdom teeth. This is something that every previous hominin had and always had. The, the wisdom teeth are disappearing in humans because we're not using them as much. Why do we have a tailbone that looks exactly like a chimpanzee's tailbone, that looks exactly like a gorilla's and an orangutan's and a gibbon's, if all of us didn't descend from something that used to have a tail, right? You could just, you could just put a spur there, but no, we, we actually have tail vertebrae. They're just tiny and they help hold up our pelvic floor, but this is developmentally something that used to be a tail, right? Um, we have the same hands. Our, our hands have the primitive proportions of earlier apes, right? This long thumb and shorter fingers. This looks like a proconsul hand. It's just a slightly more dexterous thanks to, to our larger brains. Um, we have <laughs> tons of different random features that are, are super primate -y, right? Like I mentioned earlier, you know, we were able to hold our hands directly above our head, which is really beneficial to us, but this shows up first in very, very primitive apes for suspension below the branches. Um, we have all of the same regions of the brain that a chimpanzee has. We just emphasize them in different ways. We have all of the same bones and muscles as these guys do. We just emphasize them in different ways. Uh, we're, you know, in a, a modified Miocene ape.